Canva users, I have a tip for you today that honestly, maybe you already know, but I didn't. I just learned this the other week, so I wanted to share it with you. So I had struggled for the longest time to figure out a way that I could organize my uploaded photos, especially like my branded images or my stock photos that I like to use regularly in pin creation or um, when I'm creating a social media post or any of anything that I'm trying to work on for my business in Canva. I know you can like add tags to them and stuff, but for some reason that still wasn't super helpful for me. I would do the search and I wouldn't remember exactly what I had called it or whatever it might be. But as it turned out, like I would upload the same images so many times just because I couldn't find them or because they were so far back in my uploads that I just, I didn't want to spend all the time scrolling. So I would just re-upload which is a waste of time, space, energy, all the things. So I went to Reddit. So Reddit is a place that I go to to actually help people with Trello. But when it comes to the tools that I may be not as familiar with, or I know that there are people out there who are way more into it than I am, I go to Reddit and I ask and I use their expertise to help make me better. And this was one of the things that was brought up for me that was just like, I, I couldn't believe it. So if you've been struggling with the same thing, that's what this video is gonna be showing you is this super simple but really powerful tip to help make your Canva uploads so much easier to find. Get ready to be mind blown at how stupid simple this is, <laughs> okay? So you probably already know, but maybe you don't, that you can create folders to organize your designs, right? So that it's easier to find them. So like I have my fresh pins all organized within a fresh pins folder and then within a YouTube, TSA Weekly, podcast, whatever inside of that, right? Just like you would organize files on your computer. What I didn't know is that you can actually just upload a photo directly into a folder. The typical way to upload a photo into Canva is to go into one of your designs and then when you're in a design, you just click on uploads and upload files, right? That's what I always thought you had to do and that's why I was scrolling through all this madness. But now what I have learned and what I am telling you is that you can actually create a folder. So you can see here, I've got all the folders that I've created and I've got one here called uploads and inside of uploads, I'm able to create more folders, just like I did within my Pinterest folder for stock images, screenshots, brand images, okay? And then even further, I can go even further from that if I have more than one branding shoot, right? So then when you're actually inside the folder, so all the way in the furthest folder, when you click on add new, there is an upload option and you can just upload the photo directly in here. and. Not only can you do that, but you can mass upload. So if you have an entire folder on your computer that's full of photos that you might want to use, you can mass upload them into Canva. And then when you're in one of your projects, because it's not really very helpful if you don't know how to use it, right? So when you're in one of your designs, let's go back into this one and let's create a new page. And let's say I want to pull one of those photos in. Well, it's not going to be here where uploaded photos and things like that usually are. But as you scroll down, you're gonna see this projects folder. You click on projects, you go to folders, you find your folder, and now all of those organized photos are right here at my fingertips. You'll also notice that over on the side here, the folders that you tend to go into a lot are here. So you might even be able to go straight to it from right here rather than even having to go into the folders first. So super, super simple, but wow, what a time saver. And this works on mobile too. I mean, it's like mind blowing, right? Like so simple, but how did I not know? Did you know? The online tools for your business do not need to be complicated or overwhelming. It's time to let it be easy.